need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. If you are using Microsoft Project Professional 2013 or 2010, you can make use of the Team Planner view to easily assign and manage multiple project tasks and work resources simultaneously. This view also shows how the work resource assignments you make impact other work resources within the project, so you can make additional changes as needed when assigning work resources to project tasks. To open the Team Planner view, Click the View tab in the ribbon, and then click the Team Planner button that appears in the Resource Views button group. Within the Team Planner view, you will see your work resources, or your team, shown in a list at the left side of the topmost pane. Each work resource is shown in its own row. All of the tasks to which each resource has been assigned will appear within the same row in the pane to the right. Note that tasks that do not have a start date or an end date, which are called unscheduled tasks, will appear next to the resource name within the left pane. In the bottom pane, you will see project tasks that have not been assigned to any work resource. As you assign and manage project tasks using this view, you will notice the colors of the tasks give indicators about the status of the tasks. Tasks that have actual work completed on them will show the actual work in a darker blue color. Uncompleted work is shown in a light blue color. Once a task is 100% complete, it cannot be moved within the Team Planner view. Resource tasks that have been over allocated, where two tasks are assigned to the same work resource, will be shown with a red border. Note that non-working time for resources will be shown with gray bars within the schedule. In this view, you can simply click and drag the tasks to the various rows within the panes to assign tasks to work resources, schedule tasks, and prevent over allocations. Now you can click and drag a task vertically to assign the task to a new resource row or to assign and or schedule an unassigned task. Note that when you are dragging unassigned tasks into the top pane from the bottom pane that if you drop the task into the right pane for a resource row it will be assigned to the resource in the resource row as well as being scheduled. If you drop it into the left pane for a resource row, the task is assigned to the resource but is not scheduled. You can schedule any unscheduled tasks for a resource row by simply dragging the task from the left pane into the desired scheduling period shown in the right pane for that resource row. Now you can also click and drag tasks within the rows to change the scheduled time for tasks. Note that if you want Microsoft Project to automatically resolve over allocations within the project file in this view, you can click the Format tab within the Team Planner Tools Contextual tab in the ribbon. Then click the Prevent Over Allocations button in the Schedule button group. This is a toggle button so you can click it again to turn this feature off if desired. When enabled, this feature prevents Microsoft Project from over allocating tasks to resources as you click and drag them around in the view. Also, if there are any existing resource over allocations in the project file when you click this button to turn it on, Microsoft Project will automatically resolve the resource over allocations by moving the scheduling of the tasks for the overallocated resource. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.